Hello, hello. Yeah, 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 yeah. Our island has a name now. The Game Master 800 has named our island. It is called Chocolate Island. Due to all the soil. Looks like chocolate. So I like that name. So we're going to officially name our island. And I'm going to place this sign somewhere where it'll probably never be removed. Here's good. Uh, welcome to Chocolate Island. Dope. Is Isle correct? Island. Population. One. Haha! I need more room. Sad face. There. Oh. Oops. This is officially Chocolate Island now. Anyway, um, we're going to start building. I suppose. I'm going to shut mobs off just so that you don't have all the noise. Okay. We're going to need redstone. I don't need repeaters, I need torches. And if you'll notice, I got rid of all the lava, finally. So no more random fires. Just have torches here, all the way around. Not quite as bright, but it's a lot safer. And I th think, um... Darn it, I need cobblestone. Um, I guess that's one way to get cobblestone. We're going to be replacing with this, this with wood anyway, I think. from. Oh, this is, uh, we got the timer down there. I must have got stuck and dug a hole up. Okay, gonna replace this with wood. And got some stairs on me still. Cows are really getting annoying. Really annoying. Okay. Um, just wanted to get rid of all my stairs. So what we're doing here is we're hooking these two levers up. We're gonna run a vertical wire for both of them up there.
And I'm thinking I'm gonna make the wire go out one more block. And I guess I don't need cobblestone, I can use wooden planks. And same for this side. Works. That one works, good. So we need to run wire all the way to the ceiling. You place blocks right on top of torches if you aim on top of the torch. Oh, I don't want to place it right there. Okay, it's one done. Do it for this side too. And these wires are going to control... Um, one of them is going to control whether the hostile mob's loot falls onto our wooden pads over there. And the other one's going to control if uh, the friendly mob loot falls down these pipes here. I got like this big plan I might uh, be doing here. It's going to be very complicated. Okay. Oh, now I can't get through. That's not cool. Alright, this is like uh, take number two. Or attempt number two because I kind of messed up building this. Um, it works. When the boat's like that, items can fall down the pipe into the stream. And when the boat's like this, they cannot. But the problem I ran into is I built it too close to our uh, mob evader here, so I have to move it over a little bit. Oh, don't fall down the hole. Actually, you know what, let's find that cow, because he's driving me crazy. Oh, hello. <laughs> ah, I keep shooting myself. Okay. Let's try this again. So the wire is... I had it over there. I have a feeling I'm going to mess this up again. Place a torch there. Block. So we want it so the door is over here this time. Instead of over here. Um, so, I think it works if you just branch torches like that. I hope. I guess we'll have to do it like that. Place some cobblestone. Okay. 
And when we place the door, we want the hole in the top right corner from the direction we place it. Just like that. Um. <laughs> this is actually getting kind of high. <sighs> All right, I'm going to fix it. One sec. And this is take number three. Okay, so this is a good example of the do's and don'ts in building. I built the wire first. Building the wire is the easy part. And because of that, my door was out of position. So, since building the minecart gate and getting it uh, positioned right is the hard part, I should have done that first. And now I have. That's exactly where I want the door to be. And so I need to run a wire to it now. And it's easy to change the, the path a wire takes. But it's not easy to change where the minecart where the minecart gate goes. So going to I still want it the wire away from this glass so oops because I might place uh, wood up so you can't see the wire just to make it look better so I'm going to have it spaced one away from the glass at least And we're going to build the wire from the top down. Which is kind of weird, but it works better this way. Well, that worked out pretty good. And then we run the wire to it. walk through here. That's good. And we should be able to control it with this lever now. Yep. Perfect. Alright, let's get back up there. Finish building the gate. And cobblestone around here and then let's see here some more there and then we'll place glass so that we can keep an eye on the boat Okay, so we place a sign over top of uh, the hole, and we need block over there. Actually, we'll do that later. First, we place the boat. Can't place it inside. You gotta place it, and then push it in. Okay, and. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to cover it with, uh, with glass. Uh, I forget which way to place the water. Maybe it doesn't matter. No, 
No, it matters. The other way was right. There. Let's go test it out. We're gonna pretend that a uh, bunch of creepers drop their gunpowder. Right now we have it set so that uh, their drops don't fall down here. Now we're going to flip the lever. And here they come. Awesome. Alright. That worked out pretty good. Um... <laughs> This one's going to be a little bit different. Uh, one sec. Okay, so I moved our second wire over so it matches the same as our first one. Same pattern. I had to run a wire over the feather dispenser, unfortunately. So every time you flip this, a feather is going to shoot out too. Um, not a big deal. It was doing that before anyway. Okay, so this one goes up to level 2, the hostile mobs. This one's going to control a minecart gate on level 3 for the farm mobs. Uh, let's finish this one up first. Cover this up so nothing can interfere with the boat. The boat's actually pretty stable. Okay. So now we ne just need to run uh, water streams with our items to this hole here. And let's find the wire from our second one. Right over there. Good. Yeah, so this thing's definitely in the way. Um, so we're not going to do that today. I do want to set up the spider separator thing. That should be pretty easy, I think. I hope. Um. Gonna make this go up one more. I think. And we're gonna place some signs in there. Really wish signs were stackable. Because I use them a lot. Can I break this? Yes. Good. Ah. And... Do the same for the other side. Fill that up with water. So we definitely want to separate uh, spiders here, no matter what options we have in our system. That's one thing we're going to be doing for sure. 
Um, so we're going to make a hole here that they can fit through. And... Let's see. Just going to put a covering in front so that water doesn't spill out. Place a stream of water here, I guess. And it doesn't go quite far enough. Uh, what's the trick for that again? Place another one, I think. Place one there, and then remove it. Yeah, good enough. Okay. So the tall mobs won't be able to fit through there, but the spiders will. Stream goes to this block here, so we're gonna make a little opening for the tall mobs to fit through. And at the same time, the spiders won't be able to swim up any higher because they'll hit their head on this glass block here and here. Pretty simple. Place another sign. And water. Okay. I think that's all we need. Alright, I'm going to run a test. Alright, here they come. First ones. Haven't seen it yet. Get pushed over. Good. Up. And they're ready to kill me already. I see some spiders, though. I should have thought that test out there. Oh, here come spiders. This is incredibly dangerous. Oh no, there's a jam. Whoa. Oh. What did he wreck? Oh, he blew up right here. No biggie. Oh. Alright, well, I'm going to be modifying this a bit. But that's it for today for that. We're going to do one more test yet. Alright, one last quick test here. I caught myself a sheep. Um, I One of the features of the... Level 3 is we're going to have a system to shear the wool off sheep automatically. And I want to see if this works. Placing arrows in a dispenser and shooting the sheep with it. I kind of don't think it does. But I've heard conflicting things, so we're trying it out here just to make sure. It does not work. Okay, that kind of sucks, but I have another method I'm going to be using instead, and it'll work too. But we're going to wrap it up here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.